Hey guys, so today I thought that I would bring you a dupe palette of the new tropical palette from Natasha Denona and here is what the dupes look like. If you guys are interested in finding out what shadows I think are dupes for the new palette, then just keep watching. All right, so here are the beautiful colors that I've put together that are a dupe for the Natasha Denona palette. I will put a picture right here comparing this palette to hers right here. Let's jump right into what single pan shadows I've included in my dupe palette. And they look like this. I think they look pretty similar to Natasha Denona's newest palette, which looks beautiful. I can't wait to see it in person. So let's start off at the front row. First off, we have Terracotta by Luxie Beauty. I do have a discount code below for 10% off Luxie Beauty products. I'm gonna run right through these. You can see the swatches of the Natasha Denona palette online. They already have them up on their Instagram page. Next, we have American Rose by Coastal Sense. These are $2. Unless they're having a sale, then they're 99 cents a pan. You cannot beat that price. Next, we have Spice by Morphe. So far, they're looking pretty similar to me. Next up, we have Graham Cracker from Luxie Beauty. Next up, we have this cool mustardy color called Wheatness, also from Luxie Beauty. So here is the top row so far of the dupe palette. Second row, we have Petal Peach from Coastal Scents. Second one in the second row is Honey Bun from Luxie. So far, it's a very warm tone palette. Just wait until the third row. Next, we have Chickadee from Makeup Geek. And these are all affordable shadows. I don't think any of these are above $10 a piece. Next, we have Tangerine from Coastal Scents. This is that pretty like peach to icy white shadow that she has in her palette. And then the last one in the second row is Imagine from Luxie Beauty. It's that gold and white shift color. Really, really stunning. So here's the first row, second row, moving on to the third and most colorful row. First, we have this really pretty icy blue color. This one is Tarnished Nickel from Coastal Scents. I think this one's a spot on dupe for the Natasha Denona one. Look at that color. Next, we have number, hmm. I don't know what this one's called. This one's from the Inglot Shadow System. It says MD23CA. Sorry, I don't have a color on this one. I wish I did, but this is an Inglot Shadow, and it is a bright green with a hint of shimmer to it. Stunning. I love this green. Next is that like bright royal blue one. This is... Brandeis Blue from Coastal Scents. Their shimmers are stunning for $2. I mean, they can compete with some high-end ones. They are beautiful. Here it is. Look at that color. This is starting to look tropical, guys. Next is Atlantic Blue from MAC. I think this is probably the most expensive shadow in this palette. I didn't have a shimmery deep blue, so this is the closest I could come to a deep blue dupe. There's MAC. And finally, we have this beautiful grape purple. This one's Hustler from Luxie Beauty. I think this one's spot on as well. There's Hustler from Luxie. So here are the dupes for the newest Natasha Denona palette. 
You can save yourself a lot of money by buying these $2, $5, $6 shadows versus a palette that's over $100. So if you guys are looking to buy any of these, I will have the information listed below. I also have discount codes for Luxie Beauty and links for Coastal Scents down below. But I think it looks pretty awesome and I'm very excited to play with these color combinations and see what I can come up with. Wait, 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 wait. I also had two single shadows that didn't fit in my pan that would also be good dupes. I didn't have a super metallic green pan shadow, but I do have one from ColourPop. This is Empire from ColourPop. So this would be a good dupe for the emerald green metallic. It didn't fit in the pan, but I mean, these are, these are $5 guys, $5. So that would have been a good dupe. And then I also have Coconut from ColourPop, which is like a deep blue metallic, which would also be another good dupe if you wanted another metallic-y blue option. So I hope you guys enjoyed this dupe video. Let me know if you're gonna be picking up any of the ones in my dupe palette. I'd love to hear your thoughts. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and as always, I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.